there was a study called the calorie study. And the calorie study is basically, rather than we know that caloric restriction works in animals, works in just about every single animal model. And the more you calorically restrict to a certain degree, the better the benefit you get. Well, calorie was doing this in healthy, non-obese individuals where they would calorically restrict for about two years. And ideally, they wanted them to calorically restrict by about 25 percent. Uh, but realistically, I think they only got to around 12 to 14 percent. And so if anyone's really interested in the calorie study, here's the website where you can look up everything. Um, a lot of the data, even the underlying data is all made public to everybody. And this was a paper that was shown that caloric restriction in those humans of the calorie study actually improved thymic function. So, you know, we actually can see that caloric restriction has some positive impacts on the immune system. Other groups have shown that caloric restriction uh, reduces the epigenetic clock. So that's, once again, the epigenetic changes that are measured in immune cells. It reduces circulating SAS. Um, so, you know, there's a lot of positive impacts to this, and this is probably something that, you know, we all could do and not have to sort of wait upon pharmacologics or other interventions.